I tell you what guys, I think our whole city is becoming a bit overweight. I think we need to do the interior to the gym. Hey guys, you're watching this one and only. My name is AJ. Welcome back to the episode of Let's Build a City. And yes, I think the interior of a skyscraper gym would be really cool to do. I think there's a lot of options and, and creativity that we can try and sort of come up with in here. Maybe you guys can help because I don't think we're going to get it all done today. I mean, it's, it's a skyscraper. A relatively small one, but it's still a skyscraper. But it's going to be quite easy to do the interior because we don't have any glass in it. The only glass that we have, if we go inside here, is on this ground floor. It's sort of at the, at the window areas by the doors. But if we look up, there's no glass. There's no, apart from the glitchiness, there's no actual light coming through. Let's turn those off. Which won't matter when it comes to doing the interior because we'll just have lights on it that look really cool. But from the outside, we won't have to worry about lining up the floors and things like that. We can just make it how we want to make it. It also makes it a lot easier for staircases because obviously we're going to need it. Well, I'd like to have a staircase to actually get up to each floor, but I'd also like fake elevators similar to the ones that we've done in the hospital because i think they look really cool so it'd be cool to have have like fake elevators going all the way up but then a real staircase that we can activate i'm sure there's some way with command blocks in this version that we could work out how to do um real elevators but uh it's too much work for me <laughs> it really is uh, i think the first thing that i want to do though is actually remove this door um i don't like having this side entrance on this gym I think it's a little bit weird so we're gonna take those away put those in here oops and um, probably do something like that I think just to sort of tie it all up together I like just having this one entrance on the front underneath where it says gym here okay and we're gonna have to have the floor on this level because obviously we've, we've sort of stepped up to get in here and for a ground floor if, if we work out ground floor is obviously going to be the reception area right if we work out what sort of color we want to use in the gym it'll help with the rest of the floors because we'll be able to go right it's going to be this for the floor this for this this for that uh, and it'll sort of come together a lot faster now i'm thinking i would really like to use clay some actual colors in here in fact i think a light blue could work really well as a floor in here it's sort of it's it's a color but it's a bit of a neutral color it goes with a lot of blocks that's going to drive me insane it goes with a lot of blocks a lot of different colors uh, but it looks quite expensive as well which is what you want out of a gym so how i want this to work is i actually want each level of the gym each floor of the gym to be like a, a separate thing so i've put down some ideas i don't know how many floors we can actually fit in here when it i know like you could count one two three four but let's be fair our floors aren't going to be two blocks tall or three blocks tall like that. they're going to probably be every two windows roughly will be a floor so i've got the reception obviously on the ground floor where you sign up for your membership and you, you sign in and, and um tokens or whatever whatever sort of gym this uh this sort of uses i know some use like tokens some use cards all that kind of stuff and then i want hold on i've got it written down here the second floor i want to be changing rooms and toilets okay so then that way it takes away a little bit of the sound away from the reception area because it's not going to be that loud of a floor then i wanted to go into weight machines on the third floor running machines on the fourth floor if i could if i can figure out how to make like a, a a little bike machine i'll do that as well don't worry guys i'll get some night vision potion in a second um yeah if we can get some bikes that would be cool as well to have splash ah. uh floor five i want to be yoga floor six i want to have boxing i think it'd be cool to have a little boxing training ring in here uh floor seven is going to be a sauna and then floor eight is going to be a swimming pool right at the top i just think that'd be so cool to have a swimming pool right on the top floor yeah okay this purple looks really quite cool this is a little bit low here if i um ooh. 
Could I make that into slabs? I could. If I made that into slabs, it would just make everything a little bit easier. It's going to require a little bit of redoing, though, with this string. Oh, I've already got the string and carpet. With the string and carpet. So let's just get this out of the way first. Slab. So we're going to put slabs on here. It just gives us half, literally half a block more, but it's going to make us not feel quite as claustrophobic in here. Pick all these up. Oh, yeah, and I need some... Uh, so new player sensor somewhere. I can't get them on there now. Uh, it doesn't quite work as well. We'll have to figure out, uh, I think, a, a better strategy on that. So I'll put a string back down on here. Put the carpet back on there. It fixes that up. Beautiful. Let me out. Getting in is fine. Oh yeah, that feels much better walking through. Okay, uh, I don't think I'm going to bother with the reception area. We'll probably end up doing that last because I think I think it's going to be the easiest way. I think the first thing that we need to do is work out the staircase and how high each stair needs to go before we get to the next floor. I think elevators, like like two elevators, one one here and one there, would work on on this wall, and the staircase would work up well here. And because there's no windows, we don't have to worry about sort of finding a way. To, to dodge all the windows we could just sort of go up court stairs is going to be absolutely perfect for this and i think i think we're going to want the stairs to start that's not a stair here three blocks wide two blocks wide i think two blocks wide so if we went floor to floor so this would be the next floor let's get the purple back we'll place the grass if we had the floor at this height, that way it goes purple straight into the blue here. And here it goes purple into the blue. So that would work out where exactly where each floor would be. So then we would put this down. I'll also tidy up the uh, oops, tidy up these little spots and stuff, you know, where it sort of uh, goes a bit inside out or doesn't make sense. We'll sort of neaten that up as well. But it's, it's easy, easy jobs, easy jobs. Okay, so once we've got it going up, we're then going to want it to turn around. This is actually going to work out really well because I don't think, yeah, the skyscraper doesn't get thinner in any spot. This, oops, this is a little bit of a pain though to, to do this. But I suppose, I suppose all we need to do is do it once. And we can copy and paste it for the rest. I'm hoping, I'm hoping we can, we can do, ah, mm, I tell you what, I'm going to, I'm going to move this over by one block. I'm going to take this one out so then we can get the banister in on that side. It's best to do that now before you forget. Okay, uh, I don't know how high we need to go with this. <laughs> is that glass? That glass isn't on the same... It's not on the same level as that glass. Oh, that is... That's quite annoying. That's very annoying, in fact. So I need to go up a couple more. Okay. I'm not going to worry about it. I'm not going to worry about it. Not for now, anyway. I suppose we could always realign the glass on this side if we were if we're that bothered about it. About it. Yeah. So then this should line up with this. That should technically be all I need. In fact, I'm going to delete this. That should be all I need to get all the way to the top each floor we'll also work out then how many floors we've got let's work on a little banister here uh, i don't want anything white really and i don't want anything uh of the purple for the banister i'd like it to be a different block but blends in a gray could work really well maybe mossy stone i mean mossy stone goes very well with the purple like it's, it's a really nice block and i don't want nothing too complicated either it's, it's, this is a modern build. It's, it's a modern looking... Um, oh, no, vision running out. A modern building, a modern gym. So it, it can't be... Uh, it can't be too fancy. That's quite cool how that backs onto itself though, isn't it? And then the same goes up this side. I might put some glass on here, on top. That might give it a little bit more of a, a modern touch glass we thinking 
I suppose we could go could go with purple. Ooh, ooh. You know, I don't I don't ever use purple, so maybe we should take a punt and use purple in the gym. I think that could be quite cool. I think we're we're ending up with it's a small amount of room for each floor, but I think it's gonna be enough. I'm hoping at least it's going to be enough. We've got enough room here to be able to uh, do the elevators without getting in the way. In fact, because it's so straight, I wonder if we could do... We'll do the elevator second. We'll do the elevator second. Okay, let's take this now and find out how many floors we can actually get in. So I think the easiest way would be... This block will try up to this block. And I'm going to stand right where this stair, before this stair here. I'm going to copy it. And I'm going to stand right here. And how much does that break? I don't think it breaks anything. <laughs> okay, reception. Uh, then number two is changing rooms and toilets probably. Uh, three is weight machines. Four is running machines. Five is yoga. Six is boxing. Seven is sauna. Eight is swimming pool. And I tell you what you could you could probably get a ninth floor up here if you wanted to i suppose the ninth floor could be like offices or admin or anything like that couldn't it oh that looks really cool it take a while it'll take you a while to get up all the way up and stuff but i, I think once we clear clean this up i think the ice being there as like you could imagine it being a big glass window when you're going up is really cool i think it's a really nice spot for it Okay, so elevators. Uh, I'm going to go with a, a simple design, I'm hoping. Oh, that works out really well. Even better. I, um, the ones in the hospital are actually quite big. Um, because they actually have like sides and stuff. I suppose I could move it back by one. Like that. And then it would hide up the ice on the back. I don't know if we can get them quite as detailed though because we don't really, as you can see, we're going to be touching that, have the room to go crazy with it. But that does work. And then for the closed ones, we just put some iron like that and that looks like a closed elevator. Um, I think I'll probably end up using... Iron is the open ones as well. I could put them here. But then it looks a bit too flat. I think I like that design better. Wall. I suppose we can try the ones with the lines on it. Gets a little bit of different colour going in there. And then slab. Again, I'm, I think I'm going to keep it this same. Oh no, I might go with the white actually. I think, I think that would work. Oops. Painting. Get some buttons in there. Probably on the, probably on the back. Just so you, you can see it when you're approaching. How many? I reckon 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Ooh, 6. Splash. Okay, and then above that... We're going to need to have, we, we need to just basically fill up the space between here and the next floor. Oops. And we also need to work out where the roof would be. Probably there. And then we could get some um, lights in there as well that way. Looks weird because of the um, night vision potion, so don't worry about that. So then that's where that f floor would be. So we can put um, torch. 
Oh, no. I think we'll do something different this time. Item frames. And then... Um, do I have slime? I don't have slime blocks. Um, I wanted something green. But uh, lime... Oh, we could, I suppose we could use glass. Yeah, okay. Glass. So, like, green is, is because the elevator is open. And green is it's closed. That could be quite cool. No. <laughs> Why? Item. i got to do two, otherwise it just looks weird, doesn't it? Okay, that would definitely work going all the way up. Yeah, okay. Uh, that one to that one. I'm going to stand... <clears throat> I'm going to stand right... I think I'm going to stand on here. And then that way I can just, I just know I need to be like right on the edge of this. Okay, it doesn't take the floor, but that's fine. I'm okay with that. I think I'm on the right level there. Hang on, I can just double check without having to do a big line. Uh, y on the side there is 45. Look, bang on 45. If I go over here, 45. Good. So I stand here. And then, it's alright when it's on this side because I could just join it up to that floor, but I think I just do that, don't I? I think that's how it works. Oh my, it's so tall. And yes, I know I could like do a stack command, but I like doing it like this. It's, it's less likely to get it wrong. And uh, with me, that's probably a really, really good thing. So we just stick these down. I'll have to put the paintings back on, but I uh, I won't be doing that on camera because that sucks. I also probably won't end up having all of the right ones open and all the le of the left ones closed either but for the moment just to give us an idea on on what it will sort of look like we'll probably try and alternate it as much as we can well i suppose only one needs one only one technically should be open to be fair on each side there should be one open like up there and one open like down here um, otherwise, if you had multiples, they'd crash into each other, wouldn't they? And then this would go along the front like that. And boom, you come out of the elevator and you can go straight onto the stairs if you want to go up an extra floor or can be bothered to wait. Yeah, that will work well. So we've got another interior project now. We've got the hospital, which is a big one. The, bit, the hospital's a big interior, but we're actually really trucking through that. It's not going to take all that long to complete. And this one, I think, is going to be fun because we're going to be able to do, like, a, a level per episode. And uh, now that we've got this, the hard part, if you like, out of the way, it should go relatively swimming, swimmingly. Huh? Good day top floor swimmingly uh, from there we do have two options though now and these options are we can if I put like a floor down here splash <clears throat> my voice is going I've been talking too much um, how would I clean this up as well would I put I would probably put that there and there and that's how I would, I'd clean that part up over here is that and this put a plant or something in the corner there anywhere else it needs to be cleaned up no that would be the last one okay fine so if i just fill this section in this is our 
option A for like going up the rest of the skyscraper, okay? This this whole plan only works. Oh, there's a little bit of cleaning up to do there as well. This whole plan, I don't care about going over this window here. It's not you're not even gonna be able to tell when you're on the outside. Yeah, it only works because the skyscraper has like flat walls all the way up. There's no changes anywhere or anything like that. It's exactly the same. But this would be option one. So the floors I'll clean this up makes it easier to see what's going on. Like that. Option one would be have all of the equipment in this area here. And then like this would come across something like this. We have the glass on the edge. And you have a balcony that you can see down into every level. So you'd go here and you'll, you'll sort of be able to see up floors. You'd be able to see down floors. Like that. Option two, because this is the amount of room that it gives us. On like the weight machine floor. In fact, let's go through them. On the uh, second floor, which is changing rooms. I think it's big enough. We could work out some changing rooms in here. Try and squeeze them in. Weight machines would work. Running machines would work. Um... Yoga would work because we just stick some mats down, some music machines, stuff like that. Uh, boxing. A little bit tight to get a little boxing ring in here. But I think it's doable. Uh, sauna, we can do seven. Swimming pool on eight would be a little bit small. But it's right at the top. So maybe the swimming pool could end up being the full floor. Option number two, obviously would be to like do basically I think this so you put them along there so you can still get up and down the stairs that would probably go there can I still get down like this yeah I can still get down like this so that would sort of wrap around the edge the only trouble is although this technically does give us like more room on each floor I don't think this, the room that it's giving us is all that usable. Like, for example, on the boxing, doing that isn't going to give us any more room. But I suppose on the boxing, then, I could put, like, speed speed balls, what are they called? Weather clear. You know, those things that sort of um, hang down below. I can't, I can't do one. They sort of hang down like this, and you sort of... Do, 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 do. Yeah, okay, I might do it like that, then. And then you've got a, li you've got a little banister... That goes across. I might even move that back by one. It feels a little bit tight when you walk down here. Ah! Stop breaking stuff. I'm not meant to break. Oh, make me feel sick. Oh, that is dark. There we go. You don't even like go anywhere near your head then that way. Also cleans up the bottom of the stair there quite well. I think we'd probably put upside down stairs underneath here. To smooth that off. So then when you're looking up, it that looks fine, doesn't it? When you look up there. Okay, cool. Uh, we're going to leave it there, guys. If you enjoyed it, hit that like button. If you haven't already, then feel free to subscribe. I think we're pretty well worked out now throughout the place. Um, oh, take away these. From now, it's just going to be... Uh, using our creative minds to make each floor look cool all the way up if you guys enjoyed it hit that like button if you haven't already feel free to subscribe we shall see you in the next episode bye